us lizard faces. Today we're going to show you how to make some really cool toys with stuff found in your kitchen. Okay, so here's a fun way to make some cool lava lamps made from stuff found at your house. First things first, get a jar. Take the jar lid off. If there's things in the jar, get rid of those things. Next, what you want is a little baking soda. You can just find that in your house, probably. Then just dump a little in the bottom of the cup. Next, what you want to do is you want to get some cooking oil. Okay. Yep. Then just pour that cooking oil in there like so. Next, what you want is some white vinegar. Okay. Yep. And you want to put some in a second cup. Then what you want is a little food coloring, because why not make it fun? Yeah. Then what we're going to do is we're going to just mix that up first. Okay, so when I pour these together, a chemical reaction is going to occur. So here we go. Whoa. So the vinegar is starting to react with the baking soda. Oh, it's cool. It's kind of like a weird bubble monster. That's so neat. I'm going to eat my own armpit. Yeah, sure. you do that. All right. It's so hypnotizing. And if you want to make it look really cool, you can put a light under it, just like so. <laughs> so neat. I know. Hey, Kim, can I show him one? Yeah, you can. OK, what if I told you that you can make your own modeling clay with stuff found in your own kitchen? I would explode. Well, you can. <coughs> My first time. <laughs> All right, first you get a bowl. Then you add one cup of flour. Add half a tablespoon of vegetable oil. Then you add a quarter of a cup of fine table salt. If those measurements don't make any sense to you, just ask a parent or an older friend. Then add one teaspoon of cream of tartar. Then half a cup of water. Some people like to use boiling water, but we like to be safe. Next, mix it all up, break it into pieces, add some food coloring, and mix it all up. And play! I'm Space Dragon and I'm made of dough. They call me Kim, I kind of look like a potato. I'm so cool, I live in the refrigerator. I'm so cool, I don't have no haters. Kim wishes she was me, cause I'm so neat. But if I was Space Dragon, I would have smelly feet. Oh, <laughs> burn on me. Burn. Now we're gonna show you how to make an old fashioned yo-yo type toy that spins super fast. Okay, so what you want is a pizza box. Then what you wanna do is actually unfold the pizza box so it's flat -o. Then take a cup, just like so. You're tracing it. Essentially what you want here is a perfect circle. So we're gonna take some scissors, we're gonna just cut it out. There it is, a perfect circle cut out in cardboard. Next what you wanna do is poke two holes around the center. So next what you wanna do is take some string. Then you wanna slide it through the hole just like this. Then you basically tie the string together. Now if you want, you could decorate this to look really fancy. Then this is where it's magic and it spins really cool like. So you wind her up. And then you pull and you release. And then you pull and you release. I'm doing it! Woohoo! Physics in the kitchen. Yes! Uh, I'm happy with myself. Yeah. Um, awesome. hey Space Dragon. Yeah. Are you done with that juice? Oh yeah, all done with that. I've got an idea for some fun. First, what you're gonna do is you are gonna cut this juice box on three sides. So two small sides and one big side. Yes. And look what you got. You got yourself the beginnings of a recycling puppet. Then what you do is you wanna decorate it. So after you have decorated your cool recycled puppet, it could look like this. Or if you're a little better at art, it could look like this. I am a dragon and I drink milk out of the carton and I'm really stinky, I smell like butts, but I have a cool, beautiful friend named Kim. I don't know who that's supposed to be, but he sounds awesome. Okay, I got one more. If you have a bendy straw yeah. and a plastic ball, yeah. you just blow in the straw and it'll fly. And that's all the toy tutorials for today. Thanks so much for watching us make stuff from our kitchen. Now, one of the things we really like to do around here is we like to put some mints in a pop bottle. Oh no, not this again. Get ready. If you're trying this at home, you'll want to do it outside. Well, let's see that again in slow-mo. Yeah. Woo! Right, I regret that. Woo, I'm glad I, I ran away. I regret doing that. I regret it. <laughs>